Hi, it's David from DP Computing. Um, this time I'm just going to show you an Acer Aspire 5750. Um, just how to upgrade the memory and the hard drive. We're just going to replace the hard drive on this unit because the one inside has died. Uh, now, just a word of warning before you proceed, do so at your own risk and also please take anti-static precautions. Following these steps may void your warranty on the unit or even damage the computer itself. So the first thing we have to do is remove the battery which is here. Um, to do that we've got this little orange part here. Just put in a pen I've found is the easiest and push it to the side and as you can see the battery itself pops up. You can then pull it away. Just place it to the side. Now we need to remove this panel here and there's just the two screws, one there and one there. Just a normal Phillips head screwdriver. Now these screws will remove totally, not like on some laptops. So just remove the screws. We've then got a little finger hole here. If you just put your finger in and you should be able to pull it out. Now the underside of the cover, uh, it's just fairly standard, just got a bit of rubber foam there and there and some air holes on top of the memory. Now we've got the memory here, there's a little plastic cover, just remove that and there's two silver things on the side if you want to upgrade it, just push those, um, those I suppose holders to the side and the memory pops up which you can then remove. You can just, to put it back in, just reverse it, so push it in and then push it down until it clicks. Here we've got the Wi-Fi module and there's one little um, Phillips head screw there so just unscrew that. I won't do it because then it may stuff up the little antennas connected there. Now the hard drive itself is here. It's held in by two screws which we've already removed. They're the same ones that are holding in the cover. Uh, we've then got a little plastic tab here. So just pull that outwards and the hard drive will pop up as you can see. The hard drive is held in by a little caddy and that's got another four screws, so two there on one side and two on the other side. So we can just remove those screws, pop in the new hard drive and then reverse what we've done. So thank you for watching and please visit our YouTube channel where we've got a lot of other um, laptop teardowns and openings and unboxings. Uh, the link should be appearing on your website now. Thank you for watching and I'll catch you next time. Bye for now.